So yesterday I was having a, a migraine and feeling especially nauseous, so I injected the half a cc of the metoclopramide and at, right after half a cc of the diphenhydramine. So you took 2.5 milligrams. That's correct. I wasn't clear how much to start with, so I started with the, the smallest amount, I thought. And then the diphenhydramine, um, the pharmacist had told me uh, specifically what to, to take. So. And that went into your thigh? Or yes, right thigh. Yeah. I was at home, this was six in the morning, so I was in my bedroom by myself. And within, I would say, five minutes, I was having the anxiety reaction that I remember having previously, where your arms feel incredibly anxious. It's like a fight or flight. Like, I have to get out of this room now. I have to, like, you just feel like you need to get things off your body. It's incredibly anxious, very stressful, not your usual uh, sort of mental thinking, and it's just pure panic feeling coming on and now what did you do I then because the pharmacist had told me that I could take the other half of the CC with Benadryl I did that injection and then about 15 20 minutes later it did finally pass gradually reducing over that time I could tell that it was helping but it did take sort of a full 20 30 minutes to feel like I could be normal again So you just taught me something. <laughs> Thank you. No problem. You had another experience with that drug. Yeah, this time it was with the pill form of the, the Maxran or the metoclopramide. I was taking about once a day and I was uh, for nausea and I was um, taking it with the Benadryl so I wasn't having any terrible panic reactions but in general I was having just a higher level of anxiety and then also terrible memory, memory losses. Um, I would be speaking to somebody about something wait for them to speak and then as they're talking I couldn't remember what we were talking about just it would be a complete blank and I'd sort of you know make something up and then it would really take about five minutes for me to realize oh that's what we were talking about again and that's never happened to me before so that was affecting your work oh absolutely yeah it looked like an idiot in an office real quick <laughs> how long after you stopped taking the medical from mud did it go away it's, it was getting gradually better but it was i would say at least two weeks before i was noticing that that was not happening with those dramatic uh, memory drops like that have you had that experience with any other drug? None. No. No. 